Hello YouTube. So after a very long time I'm here and I hope you guys are missing me. But today I bring the most amazing the most amazing RC and that is Nitro RC truck. And that Nitro RC truck is from HPI. Yeah. So see this is the thing, you know. Savage X 4.6 and this is from HPI Racing this is my second uh, Nitro RC truck because uh, I really like HPI products and uh, now I'm here this is my official like first branded Nitro RC truck and this thing equipped with 4.6 liter the powerful engine guys check the size of the truck so i'm very much excited for this product and i uh, i can't stop myself to open this box and it's here in my in my house for more than uh two weeks but i was too much busy no time for my hobby but finally i'm here uh today you know is weekend here so i have some uh, time so i will show you first of all guys i will show you the unboxing of this HPI Savage X 4.6 big block the Nitro RC the monster truck you know and this is my second truck first of one uh, you know what uh, that was uh, HSP not HPI so I hope you guys like the review of this and uh, uh, first of all I will show you what is inside the box this is the 4.6 liter engine and this thing comes with the automatic starter because that is the most important thing whenever you are dealing with the nitro rc truck so i hope you guys like so just check the quick quick unboxing of this big daddy hi guys so now i am here to unbox this Savage X 4.6 the big block from HPI racing, you know So this is a big brand, you know for the nitro RC and this RC I bought in uh, around uh, $500 you know five the price range of this truck is 500 to 600 dollars depend you know upon the market, but now currently this thing is uh, not available it is a little bit shortage is there for this version of the truck but I found this thing you know uh, in the from the local market I bought this truck and so now this truck actually comes with the 4.6 liter the nitro engine it also comes with the you know the starter the automatic starter so let me open the box quickly and then I will show you guys what is inside <laughs> it's a very big box so for this thing you need a special table and see oh my god i think i'm opening oh this is the big daddy now see guys the box oh my god look at the size of the truck so for this thing there is no table that will fit for the size so before showing you the truck I will show you the accessories a lot of things comes with this truck first of all I will show you the remote so this is the remote and this is a very good you know see very good packing just have a, good, have a look guys so this is perfect it comes in neat four four double a size uh, batteries just have a look need four batteries and uh, this is the cover I think the cover is open I don't know Just close this thing so this is the remote and what else comes I will show you guys now I will show you the truck this thing comes with a drill starter it's called this is a drill you know and it is packed and so let me open this thing 
And I will show you what is inside. You guys will see my favorite scissor. What a beauty, nitro start. And for this, there is a, you know, uh, battery that will give power to this starter. And this is the rod, you know. So let me show you guys the rod. So I have to. This is the remote, this is the rod, you know. Yes, and then boom, 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 boom. You can start your Nitro RC. There is no pull cord, so by pull cord you will damage your finger, you know, like be me, like this so many times, you know. But this thing is beauty, you know. You just press this button and your truck will start. So I will show you guys how to start this truck and everything, but let me show you, now I will show you the truck, it is better to show you the truck first, oh my god, oof, this is so heavy, let me remove the box, and you guys will get the idea, oof, my god, this is the beast, this is not a truck, this is a cover, very nice, very beautiful, it's printed with HPI, Some nice graphics and I think this is the 2016 or 17 model, the latest model for this truck. And look at guys, Oof. check the size. So this is 1.8 size, this truck is 1.8 size and very big engine you know 4.6 liter engine and very nice shocks see check the shocks oh my god this is beauty this truck is a beauty i don't have words to describe the this beautiful truck oh it is very heavy but guys check the quality of course this is a branded truck so everything is like you know it look, looks expensive see nice alloy wheels proper glue tires proper shockers and uh, this is a filter you know And here you can put the fuel, this is the um, fuel tank, fuel tank, and this is the engine, and uh, this is all like, you know, alloy body, these are the brakes, you know, it's a very good, see, check, no, oof, very good suspension. And uh, what else comes with this truck? Uh, I will take this truck outside and I will show you how to start, how to put fuel and how to, uh, how to break in the engine. Because whenever you are playing with nitro, so you should uh, uh, break in the engine first. And there are a lot of step by step things you have to follow, you know. This servo looks very powerful and uh, what else comes i will just move this truck check, guys. check the beauty of hpi racing this is my first branded truck so that's why i'm excited because i spent a lot of money on this thing five hundred dollars you know 
Look at the style. Look at the craziness of this wild beast. So now I will take this truck. Oh, and I will show you what else. What are the other things in the box? Because this is unboxing. See, a lot of things are still left. No idea about maybe. No idea what is this. I really don't have a lot of. Oh my God! This is the. This thing also comes with the filter oil. This is the filter oil. You know, so you can uh, use this uh, filter oil. There's no need to buy and uh, this is extra check the extra uh, you know this is the filter so sponge you can keep all these things you know and this is the stand I think to hold this truck extra stand and uh, what else these are the tire things you know very important stuff if you will lose the original one you can use cylinders you know and these all are the tire things you know and pins you know a lot of pins this also comes with the charger yes so this is the charger you know this charger oh socket oh my god these are all sockets and this is the charger for the battery of the starter you know for the starter there is a battery and yes this is the battery oh I forgot totally forgot to show you the battery my god this is a good quality check it's 2000 milliampere 7.2 volt NIMH battery this is for the drill starter guys and this is the charger and uh, what else there's still a lot of a lot of accessories are i think this is the fuel bottle so by this you can put some fuel this is the fuel bottle and this is the uh, nitro starter you know and this is the Oh, they also give you the extra glow plug. See, here there is extra glow plug. And this is the battery for this thing, you know. For this nitro starter, there is a battery to put inside. And this is the fuel bottle. A lot of, lot of, you know, uh, accessories this comes. This. And there is a nice, uh, very nice, you know, uh, user manual. So, so don't throw this thing, guys. And there is information related to warranty of this product. You know, see, kit card, HPI racing, blah 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 blah. So a lot of lot of benefits. You have to read this manual. So in this, uh, in this, uh, in this truck from HPI racing. The maximum speed is 45 plus miles per hour. That is the you know they're you know they're they're showing the maximum speed and on the box. And I will check when I will try this thing. And this also comes with the maximum power you guys can have. Oh look, this is the engine, the 4.6 big block engine pumps out nearly three horsepower of nitro action so this is the engine and it also comes with the two speed transmission two speeds uh, you know the gear the transmissions and this is a very strong chassis dual disc brakes you know so these are the main main feature for this one eight size uh, savage x 4.6 this is i think more than one eighth scale and this is a very big truck now i just this is the box i will throw this box and I will, I just, uh, you know, put some batteries, uh, around 8 AA size batteries in this 
big boy and now you can uh, see this uh, here you need uh, if you guys can have a look you need four AA size batteries and it is better you can replace with the lipo battery because these cells will over uh, maybe in one or two runs you know in one or two tanks so after that you have to change the batteries because it is very dangerous to run with the low battery because this truck will uh, you know uh, out of control if the batteries are weak you know so always use some good uh, you know good quality batteries in this uh, in this box and then uh, this is the remote uh, you know and in this one I place four AA size battery so now the remote is turned on and then there is a button here you can see here you know this side there is a button so you have to turn it on and then you can check see this is the, the servo very strong servo and these are the oil fill shocks and this servo is 9 kg yes is a 9 kg is a good size see yes and then you can this is the throttle control so so but now I will check this thing outside because here I cannot put a nitro fuel and then I will test this thing uh, this 1.8 size Savage Axe 4.6 HPI racing outside and then I will show you guys the god oh, this is heavy just have a look this truck is so mean you know I like it now I'm back and uh, see there's a fuel I just uh, fill this uh, bottle with the fuel and I'm using 15 percent you know fuel and uh, so let me fill the tank with this fuel and then I will start the first see the seal <laughs> now let me fill this thing with the fuel so guys be very careful hello hi guys so now I'm back actually yesterday there was some problem in this thing but now it's fully charged and uh, let me try my luck today this is my HPI Savage X 4.6 liter and uh, I'm trying to start this truck for the first time guys have a look and you can see uh, the fuel is uh, there already uh, I refuel this uh, tank again you know you can have a look everything is fine the only thing is I have to start and I have I have to finish the break-in process so let me turn on and then turn on the remote okay so good so far so good now let me start me little uh, prime the engine first just a little so I have to hold the exhaust okay and then I change the glow plug also and then Yes, see, so there's some current. Yes, so finally it's working. guys this time it's working okay. mm. I think I have to prime 
again. Not an easy task to start the nitro. Again, I have to prime the engine. I wish I will not uh, flood it the engine. The engine is started and this is the break-in process so I have to leave the truck I have to leave the engine for maybe for uh, I have to finish this tank full and then uh, because this break-in process will take around maybe uh, one or two tanks you know so now I cannot play with this truck because if I will play right now this will lose the uh, you know the, uh, the warranty of the engine so let this thing uh, stay here. This is the break-in process, guys. Check. So now is the. Uh, more than 20 minutes and still the fuel is still there you can see so still the break-in procedure is still going on you can check the level of the fuel guys so still need maybe I think 10 more minutes yes this process is very slow After a lot of struggle, my truck has started and you can see, now I am running for the second time, so I have to run slow slow.
So I am running for the second time so I will not uh, use the full throttle. So this is the Savage. guys this is my HPI Savage I think the tires are a little loose so let me check the tires Vibration in my truck, I don't know why. This is vibrating. You know? I'm just touching the throttle I'm not using the full throttle at this moment my HPI Savage for the first time I don't know why it's vibrating I don't know the reason why it's still vibrating but I'm not using the full throttle guys see there's a vibration to connect all the pins maybe is the reason so I 
connect all the pins yes. now we'll check either two now it's better This is the power of HPI Savage. Actually, after this tank, I will do the tuning for this one because now I cannot do the tuning because it will take at least after two tanks. I have to finish two tanks in slow speed and then I will go for the tuning, guys. Check the beast. is running too much rich that means too much fuel is consuming just is good for the engine for the first time truck is a beast it's very big size For the second time, this is 
my second tank. Check the HPI Savage 4.2 or 6. 4.6, yes. Fun to play with this toy. So I'm not using the full throttle because if I will use the full throttle, see guys. This is my second run, so on second run I have to be very careful, I will not damage the engine. If I will use the full throttle this is very dangerous and after this train I will do the tuning guys. So on next video I will show you how to tune this truck, but this is the maximum speed on stock because right now the needle is on stock settings, you know, the fast speed needle. Low speed and high speed needle. So high speed needle is currently on stock position. So that is the maximum speed on touching the throttle. So this truck need a lot of a lot of tuning because the HPI Savage is very fast truck guys. This truck is lethal. There is a lot of vibration. I don't know what is the reason because I, I will I will I will find it out why the truck is there is a lot of vibration. If I will put more throttle, maybe it's for the first time. That's why. Still, this is the break-in uh, process still going on, you know. Have a look, guys. Meet my new truck, HPI Savage 4.6. The steering is very nice. It's fun to play with nitro, but this nitro starting process is frustrating. It's need a lot of a lot of patience. But this is not like playing with the batteries. When you are playing with the nitro, and if you have a huge fuel tank, you will enjoy for more than 30 minutes, you know, I'm sure. Now it's more than 20 minutes I'm playing and still the tank is half, you know. And the good thing is when you play with the nitro, you really like the throttle. The touching of throttle will give you the pleasure. It is just like you're driving a rail car, you know. See, hang, 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 hang. That is the thing which I really like for the nitro. This pleasure is not able to tell you at this moment. So you have to try, you have to play with the nitro car and then you will enjoy. Of course there is a lot of lot of effort when you configure, when you tune. But after everything is done, so then there is a lot of pleasure. See guys.
sound of nitro I really like, you know. See guys. The range is also nice, see? <coughs> the range for this truck is also very nice, you know, it's not a shot at all. It's coming slowly, slowly. It's coming slowly, slowly. 